In this video, we are going to be talking about average. It will be a very short video. So, what is the average of the set 1, 2, 3? So, we apply average on a set of numbers. And a set of number can be from one number to any number that we want or any number that is given to us. So, to find the average of my set right here i will do one plus two plus three and then divide it by three otherwise we add all numbers from our set and we divide it by the number of number in our set and in this case we have one number two number three number that's why we divided this by 3. So we will have 1 plus 2, which is 3, plus 3, which is 6. And now divide by 3 equal to 2. Why did we perform this one? First, remember, in our video order of operations, when there is parentheses, we do the parentheses first. So I'm going to rewrite it here. My set is 1, 2, 3. Three numbers one number two number three numbers so what I do is I add the numbers of my set with that's one plus two plus three all right I put my parentheses around them and I divide them by how many numbers do I have there one two three three so I perform my operation inside the parentheses 2 plus 1 that's 3 plus 3 that's 6 and divide by 3 and my final answer is 2 another one what is the average of my set 7 7 7 okay so how many numbers do i have in my set 1 2 3 i will divide by 3 right so what are the numbers that I have in my set? 7, 7, 7. And I will add all them. I'll put my parentheses because I will be adding first and dividing second. So 7 plus 7 plus 7, 21. 21 divided by 3 equal to 7. So the average here is 7. Sometimes we know the average, but there is a missing number in our set that we need to find. Say we have the average of uh, our set 4, 6, a number that we don't know, we call x for now, 7, and the average, I'm going to call this AVG, just average equal to 5. And the question is to find the value of the x. What is x? So if we remember what we said previously, we add everything from our set. 4 plus 6 plus x plus 7. And we divide it by one number, second number, third number, fourth number. So divided by 4. And... Uh, that should give us 5. Let me rewrite it here. I have 4 plus 6 plus x plus 7 divided by 4 equal to 5. So there is a better approach uh, of solving this. But for now, let's do this. What number divided by 4 should give me 5? What number here? divided by 4 should give me 5. Uh, I will choose 20. 20 divided by 4 is 5, right? This division is right there. This 4 is right there. This equal is right there. This 5 is right there. So this whole thing right here inside my parentheses should be equal to 20. So I have 4 plus 6 plus x the number that I don't know plus 7 that should give me 20 okay let me count these numbers that I have and see what is missing from 
8 to give me 20. So 4 plus 6, that's 10, right? Now 10 plus 7, that's 17. Now 17 plus x should give me 20. So 17 plus what number is equal to 20? 17 plus 3 equal to 20. So here my x equal to 3. And I just write x equal to 3. So as I said, we will redo this one later in solving equalities. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, and uh, see you.